Well, guess who's back? It's Orko time with his faithful colleague and forever enjoyable turtle man, Tank House. How you doing, everybody? Me? Oh, thank you. Thank you for asking. I'm doing okay. I'm glad you guys are all right, too. And or I hope your day gets better if you said you weren't doing all right. <laughs> Today on Cube World, uh, I have some explaining to do, I suppose. It looks like I already cleared this castle out. Because on the weekend, I attempted to do a Cube World live stream, which failed miserably. Because Cube World is not a streamable game. At least for me. I can't, uh, computer can't handle it. It's too, uh, it's too beefy, I believe. Too many pixels for the old stream to enjoy. So, we're going to have to work on that another day, maybe. I'm not sure if there's anything I can do. There's not too many adjustable... Oh, jeez. There's not too many adjustable settings in the game. Because, oh, jeez. I'm going to get killed. I'm going to get killed. Let's just fly away while we have a chance. Dang. Dang, man. Dang. Uh, there's not... Yeah, the game is, you know, as you may have heard, the game is still in alpha. So, there's not too much we can do about adjusting things to make it easier to run. And, uh, so that's, that's that. It's just very, very, very jumpy. It looks alright, but it's very jumpy. Uh, so that kind of sucks. But it's alright. We still got Trove for that. And I'll just record episodes as per usual. And put them out on the YouTubes. Come on, Tank House. I see you running. I see you running. Alright, let's do this thing. Where are we going to head now? Um, let's go west. Go west, young man. So that's what we'll do. That's the plan. Stan. If there are any actual stands out there, man, don't you feel special today? Woo! All right, everybody. So, yes, we are back. It's a Monday. Hope everybody had a great weekend. I sure did. I got, uh, I got Slime Rancher this weekend. Started playing that. Man, that game is so freaking cute and oddly entertaining. When I was watching the first initial glimpses at it on the YouTubes and whatnot, I was kind of like, um, really? Uh, why is this game Why is this game popular right now? I don't understand. Uh, but I did end up watching Captain Sauce's videos, and that guy always has a very good... Uh, a very, a very good way of making me enjoy things that I normally wouldn't enjoy, maybe. Like The Sims. I'm, I'm never going to play The Sims, I don't think. But uh, when he plays it, it looks like a lot of fun. And then when I watched Slime Rancher, I was like, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I kind of see I kind of see the appeal here. I might have to get it. And I figured, you know, I got some Christmas money kicking around. And uh, it looks like the kind of game that would be enjoyable to watch. Uh, and it's good quality uh content for all ages which is which is another thing i like to kind of think about once in a while on the channel i've been doing a lot of telltale games and those not not for all ages so i figured i'd mix it up a little bit and do something adorable and it it's so fun man it's so fun i've been having a blast capturing those slimes and picking up their poops it's pretty great hey buddy you gonna help me out i will try to help you out make sure we don't die yeah, yeah. Oh, it's the big show. It's a big bad show tonight. Uh, enough with the wrestling themes, guys. Enough with the wrestling theme, Armor Time. Keep it in your head. But yeah, we're back. We're back. And I, I gotta say, I need to react to something, guys. So don't tell the Fine Brothers. <laughs> Big news in the YouTube uh, world this weekend as the Fine Brothers, which I wasn't personally subscribed to in the first place, um, they really stirred the pot. They really stirred the pot this weekend. They released a video talking about how they were going to be trademarking, um, I guess, the word react? Or the <laughs> they're trademarking their system of video making in which they react to videos, which... Uh, like straight up, in all honesty, is stupid because uh, they weren't the first people to do this, I guess. 
there were other people to do this, like, even before YouTube was invented. <laughs> uh, the example I've seen online a bunch of times, which immediately I thought of, was kids say the darndest things. It was definitely just a, a reaction type of video or a series or whatever. Uh, but, yeah, so these guys have stated that they want to trademark reaction videos and the word react on YouTube videos and all this good stuff. So, I mean... This is a pretty, pretty, uh, pretty hubris filled move, uh, to think that you are the be all end all of reactions. And, uh, I gotta say though, it did cause quite a stir and, uh, seems to have gotten quite the reaction out of everybody. <laughs> but seriously, uh, people are pissed. Uh, a lot of YouTubers are pissed. People are talking about it right and left. If you don't know who Dan Bull is and you have not subscribed to Dan Bull, go check out his latest rap battle rap video in which he's, he wraps his open letter to the Fine Bros, uh, telling them what dopes they are for being so full of crap. Oh, that was with my light on? Jeez, this light sucks. I need to get a new light for Orco time. It seems like he's got the, uh, doesn't have a great one. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. I'll check it out in a second. Actually, I gotta check out the armor. Anyways, I was, I was asked to check out armor. Did I misjudge this? Where's the place? There should be a place here. Am I mistaken? Let's head back here and see if we can find something. But yeah, so, uh, so yeah, there are there are tons of people talking about it. There's a there's a stream that's been up for like 17 hours at this point. Uh, which is a live count of their sub numbers, which, I mean, it's funny to watch, and it's just, like, going down and down and down and down and down. People in the chat are what makes the uh, the whole experience enjoyable. People just, first of all, there's lots of people spamming garbage and hate and all that stuff, not only for the Fine Brothers, just for everything in general. Um, I wish there was a couple moderators on that <laughs> website. But, you know, whatever. It is what it is. It's just a sub-counter. But the uh, the funny thing is it's just, like, dropping dropping so much. But at the same time, I can't help but feel kind of crappy because they're losing more subs per minute than I have, <laughs> than, I, than I have gained over the past two years. So I'm kind of like, oh, geez. And at the end of the day, I mean, I still have... I have all the emeralds I need. Wow. They still have 13 million plus subs, so I'm kind of like, okay. Okay. We really need to get everyone on board this train. Maybe some people haven't heard the news yet that they should hate them and gotten on board the uh, the hate train or the, the uh, you know, the, the unsub bandwagon. Um, but, you know, I think also they may be... I don't know if they're one of those groups that are just auto sub to everybody. So some people might not even really realize that they are sub to them. I'm not sure exactly how that works. I think, uh, ooh, ooh, a Cyclops. Is that the boss? Is that the boss we're trying to beat? No, man, we missed something. Or it's just off. I don't understand. I don't understand this place. Anyways, let's go kill a Cyclops. Let's do it. Um, but yeah, so that's, that's pretty much the, uh, reaction news. it will be interesting to see how this all kind of pans out. Um, in the meantime, there's tons of jokes around about, oh yeah, you leveled up. That's good. About, uh, trademarking different words and this and that. I made a little meme, uh, of the Mario brothers hanging out being like, excuse me, we have a few words. To, uh, to to drop on you about trademark because the fine bros, the Mario bros, you know, it makes sense. Oh, geez. How did I miss that? That was crazy. I just jumped off to the side. Not, not freaking cool. Boom. Get wrecked, Cyclops. Get so wrecked. All right. Wow. That, that looks like some decent stuff. All right, enough about that. Let's uh, let's check out our armor and things so you can do this. I did do this on the stream, but I wasn't actually able to uh, really upload that and feel good about myself. So I just kind of let it sit in the YouTube and we'll do this. Trust me, you did not want to watch it. But here you go. We got some Power 81 
uh, and Power 53 adapted iron great axis. I love these because when you do this spin, it's just like, oh snap, it looks great. It looks great, um, but yeah, they're pretty cool. They're pretty cool indeed. Uh, we've got a couple of rings with the crazy purple three stars on them, on both of them, 65 power, 64 power. Oh, Aruron's handsome silver ring. Oh, very cool. And what's this one? Extraordinary silver ring of Allagram. Pretty decent stuff. Iron shoulder arm, power 53. So yeah, this stuff is a lot below my power level, but the legendary, mythical, whatever status of it kind of helps bump it up to being decent, decent stuff for Orco time. I got an amulet, power 67, adapted. A lot of the stuff is adapted. I made it up myself. Power 78, iron chest, and superb iron gloves, power 84. Those are actually almost my level. Here's my iron lamp, which I don't think is very good. I'm pretty sure it's crap. I should go to the uh, the world we use for face records and get myself a good lamp. Iron boots. These are almost my level. Still could be a lot better. There's my hang glider. There's my turtle. Turtle's a level 54. Doing pretty great. Uh, and I have just a lot of stuff. Orco time is a hoarder. <laughs> He's got... He's got everything, everything you could ever want. Uh, unlimited inventory is really, really great. Um, this stuff is way below what I need it to be. But yeah, we got uh, some interesting things here. Lots of rogue stuff, of course. That's just how it is. You always have tons of stuff for the class that you are not. Uh, I don't think there's anything specifically I should be changing to, so we're just gonna, we're just gonna probably keep on. Keep on rocking in the cube world. Do, do, do. Keep on rocking in the cube world. I freaking love Keep on Rocking in the Free World. Neil Young. Neil Young? Yeah, that's right, right? For some reason, my brain's like, you said that wrong. Oh, yeah, I said Neil Young, but I was thinking Bob Dylan. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good. Neil Young. Keep it. Yeah, that's right. Keep on rocking in the free world. I think I gotta make a cover of that, uh, like a parody uh, cover song. Keep on rocking in the cube world. Nobody steal my idea, and if you do, send me a link because <laughs> I think it's awesome, and you probably do a better job than I would. I don't even have a guitar right now. Or if someone wants to collab with me and send me a music track, like an acoustic "Keep on Rocking in the Free World" or some kind of cover. I'll sing if you want. Just putting that out there in case anybody's interested. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I think that's it. Oh, yeah. And also, if anyone wants to make a, an, an instrumental cover version of um, uh, Rick Astley's Never Gonna Give You Up, I would, I would also like to sing over that because uh, if you've seen some of my past videos, you might have noticed the oop dat trend we've got going on in the Brew Gaming Network. Just waiting for updates and everything. People made up the word oop dat. And it's now become a constant meme slash constant spam icon in our chat. And everyone just praises the almighty oop dat. Uh, so I guess it's kind of like our uh, our mascot is oop dat. But uh, so yeah, I was I, I was thinking it would be great to have a little, a little bit of oop dat roll. Uh, like, never gonna give you oop dat, never gonna let you oop dat, never gonna run a oop dat, and oop dat. That'd be pretty good. So, <laughs> I don't know if you guys think I'm crazy now or not, but if you just started thinking that, then, wow, where have you been for the past 200 episodes? <laughs> or 120, I guess. Is this, this is episode 120, I believe, for Orco Time, so... Congratulations, Orco Time. You are a beast of Cube World r renderers. Cube World, what is it? Oh my goodness, look at all these these ember golems, man. They're everywhere. They're everywhere. I can't beat them. Um, I really can't. They're tough. They're tough as balls. Wait, are balls tough? Balls seem like they're very fragile, so I don't know if that's an appropriate statement. Anyways, guys... Guys, I think with that, you can tell that I'm pretty much, 
I, I've run out of stuff to talk about, and I'm rambling. And when the topic turns to bald, you know it's time to end the episode. So thank you very much for coming out, you guys. Oh! It's been a pleasure hanging out in Cube World with you guys again today. And hopefully you'll come back for another one. I swear, I'm not that crazy. Until next time, guys, this has been Armor Time and Oracle Time and Tango's the Turtle. Have a good one and take it easy. Peace.